Hey guys, we've done, um, we're doing something a little different here. I've had an uptick in questions about uh, Gluta Shield, and it's a particular product that I love and adore. It's, it's definitely a tool for a lot of people's toolbox to help their regimen work. And uh, a lot of people are wasting money on probiotics. I mean, without this Gluta Shield, I think it's an unbelievably important product for a huge population. Uh, so I want to tell you all about it and what it does, okay? So Glutashield is a product by Orthomolecular that when, you know, people are taking probiotics, right? And they're like, hey, I'm gonna do it to boost my immune system. Or they have ulcerative colitis. Or they have, they have 10 different disease states and the first thing they wanna do is treat the gut, which I agree with. Well, I can't tell you how many times doctors and, and fellow uh, wellness doctors, MDs, whatever, gastroenterologists, they forget to think about biofilm and they forget to think about slime I call it slime or the biofilm and they forget to think about the medium on which bacteria grow so if you take your finger and like swab the inside of your mouth it's slimy right well that should go all the way down to your colon okay your large intestine that slime layer does a lot of different things it's where your IgA part of your immune system lives okay it's also where bacteria grow. Now, there's a lot of reasons why people have a problem with their biofilm. They could have dry patches, okay? They could have inflammation. They could have irritable bowel, whatever these little, they could have gluten sensitivity. But either way, it doesn't matter. What happens is if you're taking a probiotic and it's not working, it could either be A, a bad probiotic, or you could have a biofilm problem. So what I wanted to talk to you specifically about, and I have a couple drawings to kind of help you understand, is Glutashield is a very specific product, chock full of, of N-acetylglucosamine, it has aloe, these are really, what we're focusing on is slime here, and then it has high dose glutamine, zinc, zinc bisglycinate, it has a couple products that help the cell wall of your intestinal wall grow, okay? Let me explain. <clears throat> this is, let's say, your large intestine, okay? Food cruising down this way. If you look under a microscope, this cell wall has these things called microvilli, and then above them, this is like a terrible drawing of biofilm. This is where bacteria grow. So food tumbles along here, hits this, bacteria break it down. If there's, there's pathogenic bacteria, your IgA, your immune system grabs it, and it goes down and is excreted as a stool. But all this protective biofilm keeps these microvilli up, and then nutrients, not food, nutrients, selenium from something, goes down in here and comes into the body, and your body utilizes it. There are a ton of my patients, and I know hundreds, millions of people out there, <clears throat> their intestinal wall, this is a terrible look, I got the, like explosions going on, <clears throat> but what I'm finding out is their intestinal microvilli, healthy, is tattered and torn, and there's no biofilm. So if you think about this problem, food, let's say gluten, even if you're not sensitive to gluten, or a popcorn kernel that's not digestible comes down and scrapes along this wall causing inflammation this swells up and then you're having malabsorption of food you're having it stops because it's dry you're having constipation and backup and then fits of diarrhea but more importantly your immune system isn't growing here because it's dry you're not absorbing your foods, and then your bacteria don't have anything to grow on. You know, makes sense? So what we want is a nice biofilm for bacteria to grow, and we want healthy microvilli that you absorb nutrients and not food. In this scenario, when you have these big gaps, let's say you ate a turnip or something, so this turnip's going down, chunk of turnip, it gets into your body. So now you got a chunk of turnip, not 
the vitamin B12 that's in a turnip, 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 gets in your bloodstream. Then your body has to push it out. This is where we get rashes from. This is where we have exacerbations of asthma. This is where inflammation starts coming on. And then we get anxiousness, hey, exacerbations of ADHD. Pro kids that have ADHD tend to have problems with their GI tract. People that don't sleep well, their large intestines, you talk to somebody with ulcerative colitis or irritable bowel or their bowels are all messed up, they're not sleeping well. And a lot of them are depressed, okay? It all comes down to this area in the large intestines. So what I want everybody to think of your melatonin, your serotonin, all these, bi all these hormones and stuff are innervated in the large intestine. You're not just absorbing nutrients to keep you healthy. You're not just growing a nice biofilm for your immune system. You're actually activating melatonin and serotonin, all these things that make your whole body work. So what Glutashield does, what I use it all the time, and this is the reason why I'm doing this particular product, is it creates this biofilm and then regenerates that mucosal lining wall. So the zinc bisglycinate and the glutamine at really high doses regenerate this. So it gets looking like this. Then you throw in a probiotic. And guess what? The probiotic's gonna grow and the probiotic's gonna keep your immune system high. And then this environment, you're going to the bathroom, right? Inflammation's down, anxiety's down, rashes are down. I mean, you'd be surprised what I've cleaned up by using this one product by Orthomolecular to aid probiotics work, okay? It's not an infomercial. I don't work for Orthomolecular, but I'll tell you what, they knocked one out of the ballpark on this one. I utilize it all the time for people that I think are moving in this direction and once you're like this, you use this stuff once every four days or twice a week. So a tub can last you almost, you know, a half a year. So treatment, one scoop twice a day for four days, then start cranking in your probiotic. Since I'm talking about orthomolecular, why don't you do orthobiotic now? But let me know if you have questions. But after four days, I can make it look like this and then your symptoms go away and then you just do it once or twice a week after that. So where I think a lot of treatment modalities across the US are failing is they're not focusing on the fact that whatever you put in there, if your lining looks like this, you're not gonna have a place for the bacteria to grow. So you can put in thousands of dollars worth of probiotic, it's not gonna work. So I want everybody to start thinking about if you have some of these symptoms, or you've been using a probiotic and you just don't think it's working, or irritable bowel, constipation, or you just want to do something once or twice a week to make sure all the money you're spending on fish oil and immune system boosters and probiotics are going to work right, Glutus Shield's your product. I sell a lot of it because I, I love the effects I get out of it. I'm about 100% on people calling me back and saying within a week or two, they have really turned their whole life around and now they're only doing it twice a week to maintain, all right? This is one of those things you're gonna have a tool in your toolbox to keep that gut nice and healthy. If you have any questions, please call me at the pharmacy or send me an email, Pharmacy at gmail, or get on my website, check everything out, and then call me, and then we'll discuss on a good regimen for you, okay? Thank you. Happy New Year to you guys. It's January, and I really hope everything's good with you guys. See ya.